Hi, I'm Emily Campbell. And I'm Jonah Asper. We're here at Backpack the Briefcase. Learning about business dining etiquette. Concordia students are getting prepared to enter the workforce. That may include professional cocktails, dinners, and schmoozing. This event, hosted by Concordia Advancement and Alumni Relations, aims to help students enter dining situations with confidence. Corey McCormick is back at university to enhance his business knowledge, but there are no classes in school that teach manners. At work, I attend a lot of um, business lunches, business dinners, uh, so I thought it would be really beneficial for me to um, learn a bit about business etiquette at dining events. The evening started with a networking session, where wine and hors d'oeuvres were served. The workshop was led by a dining etiquette advisor, who provided tips about everything from giving a good handshake to where to place your name tag. Name tags go on the right. The dinner workshop covered all of the intricacies and protocols of fine dining. Some students were surprised about some of the lesser known rules. How to use my fork and my spoons and what not to do, like doggy bags, you don't ask that in restaurants. Something that we usually do without thinking. The uh, utilization of the spoon at the dessert. Well, to be fair, I always thought it was their coffee spoon. Dining etiquette is just about presenting yourself with the kind of polish that shows you can be taken seriously. A lot of these Concordia students are going to be using these newfound skills when they enter the workforce. We also learned some things. Here are some tips for making a good impression at dinner. Don't drink too much. Don't get distracted by your cell phone. Don't eat like a slob. Don't eat your neighbor's bread. Yours is on your left side. Remember, your drinks are to the right of your place setting. Hold your knife and fork correctly. And most importantly, be confident and put a smile on your face. Dining etiquette, it's not just learning how to hold up a pinky with your um, teacup. It's a matter of putting people at ease, being thoughtful and courteous towards them, and not doing something that you know might offend them. Because about 70% of all deals are done over meals. There was plenty of time to practice our fancy new skills in preparation for a bright future ahead. From Concordia Now News and Events, I'm Emily Campbell. And I'm Joan Asper.